We got another essential part from Z1 Off-Road for the Nissan Titan, and we're running out of daylight to get this thing installed, so let's get to it. This, of course, is the skid plate for the oil pan region of the Titan. And it is, actually. Listen to that. Heavy duty. This is pretty solid. Pretty solid skid plate. This is going to be a great addition. And I am just excited to see that there's no riv nuts. If you guys have been following along, you know that there are riv nuts required for installation of the under shroud for the uh, Q50. That was annoying. But this looks like we got just pretty standard hardware. Let's get to it. Putting the uh, service panel in place. These look like the obvious bolts that we use to do it. And we remove the existing panel. 12s. And that, friends, is all there is to it. Pretty quick and simple installation. You just need a couple of different size sockets. I wish they're all the same, but that's a, that's a minimal complaint. Looks pretty good. Should protect our oil pan pretty well. Uh, looking forward to getting the uh, transmission skid plate as well as the skid plate for the fuel tank. That should be good. Those should be coming up soon, so if you guys stick around for those. This factory plate actually isn't all that bad. It's at least metal. The other ones are plastic. That's not good. Am I leaking oil? While we're at it, we're gonna put the little screen protector on. I thought about just cutting up like an iPad one, but I actually found these made for the Nissan Titan. Would you look at that? It's gonna fit perfectly. Wet and dry wipes. Dry. Turned out pretty good. There we go. Fits perfectly. Nice and clear. No complaints. Link in the description below. Fits perfect. Now, some people are not a fan of the factory skid plate on these. They think that silver just kind of stands out and doesn't fit. I actually don't mind it. I think it looks pretty good. The problem I have with mine, personally, is that they had the license plate in there so there's these holes drilled in and then some discoloration obviously where the license plate was covering and i just want to smooth this all out and rather than taking it off and prepping it and painting it i think i'm just going to wrap it in vinyl and i got some carbon fiber vinyl we're going to see how that turns out i just went ahead and took it completely out just because it's only four bolts and then just loosen two up toward the back to slide it in and out. So it's easy to remove. You have to take it off to change the oil filter anyway, it appears. So now that it's out, I can wipe it down, make sure it's all clear. And then we're going to use some of this Vivid Vinyl carbon fiber wrap. I wish it was more silver because I do kind of like the contrast with the black accents, but carbon fiber will look cool. Probably should have washed it 
This is mostly all under the truck anyway, so I'm not super worried about it, but I do want it to be nice and adhered around this first curve. Let me know what you guys think now. I actually like that carbon fiber contrast between the flat black and the white. I think it actually looks decent. I didn't mind the silver myself personally, but carbon fiber looks pretty darn good. It turned out pretty, pretty decent. Thanks for watching this one, guys. More to come for the Titan. See you in the next one.